so close. Just turned some dust. All right, Nathan Drake. Oh, none of those are good. Conflicted. I'm lost. The world's falling apart around me, and I'm trying to do the right thing. It's the journey that matters, Marcus. And I can't find any answers. What would you say if you were here? What should I do, Carl? They're killing us. I don't want to answer violence with violence, but what choice do I have? There's always a choice. I could stick with Lost. <laughs> he said that twice already. I could stick with it a third time. But I remember when I played the piano, Carl said to me, he said, I seem to have more heart than most humans. Which means he liked the idea of me expressing emotion. He's a painter. He's all about expressing emotion. I miss you, Carl. I miss you too. <laughs> I miss you so much. He was eight years older than my mom. started this. Wow, I can't even interact with him? Really, I just walk by. Yeah, you thought I was dead, buddy. That's right, I'm not dead. Wow. Yep, it's because of what he did that paved the way. Whether he accepts that or not, he'll have to live with it. Where the heck are we? Sticks coming off. <laughs> Heaven. Heaven. <sighs> Back me. Okay. One of the options that I could have talked to about with Carl is uh, a big decision. Is that this? Talk to your people. Apologize to Kara. Decide. Oh no! Uh oh. Okay. Well, where's Connor? Wait. That's Simon. Um. That's Kara and Alice. Without Luther. Are you Connor? I don't recognize you without your beanie. Who the hell are you? Hold on. Where is Connor? That's Josh. Um. Where the fuckity fuck is Connor? Yo. I wanna. Okay, hold on. I'm, I know we're. I'm just gonna go to Kara. For now. Hi. I thought you'd be safe staying with us. I was wrong. You need to leave the city while you still can. Getting Alice away from here is all that matters now. We have to catch the last bus. We might still have a chance to cross the border. Where is Luther? Marcus. Save our people. 
the, the guy's got enough pressure, right? I mean, this is a very, very serious situation, and he's taking it upon himself to be the leader, which is a huge responsibility. But he doesn't need that. He doesn't need that. You are north. I don't want to talk to anybody except Connor. But the only options I'm getting are Simon, north... Oh, there he is. There he is. God, hiding back there in the corner. You creeper. Decide his fate does not sound good. It's my fault the humans managed to locate Jericho. Connor, it's not. It's those that built you. I was stupid. You weren't stupid. I should have guessed they were using me. I'm sorry, Marcus. I can understand if you decide not to trust me. After what you did, you saved us. You saved us, Connor. Saved me and North, at least. And I think Josh was with me, too. Of course, buddy. Of course. You're one of us now. Your place is with your people. There are thousands of androids at the Cyberlife assembly plant. If we could wake them up, they might join us and shift the balance of power. You want to infiltrate the cyber? I don't want to. Oh, God, that's going to go so bad. Connor, that's suicide. They trust me. They'll let me in. If anyone has a chance of infiltrating cyber life, it's me. If you go there, they will kill you. There's a high probability. But statistically speaking, there's always a chance for unlikely events to take place. <laughs> You're in a Vulcan coming out there? Statistically speaking. Be careful. Connor would make a good Vulcan. <laughs> Alright, I don't have a choice. Connor has to go. Okay. Alright, we're all good now. We're good. Who do I want to talk to? Josh, Simon, or North? I, I want to go talk to Simon. I want to go talk to Simon. I like Simon. I like Josh, too. North's okay. Okay. Hey, buddy. Is that a blue-haired Tracy in the background? No, that's you two! That's you two! Look at you two! It's them! From the Eden Club! They're together! Behind them! Do you, you guys see them, right? Connor, your wife is on the other side of the room! Go say hi! <laughs> people are counting on you, Marcus. I mean, <laughs> Brian. You're the only one who can lead us. I'm well aware. Again, with this Where guilt trip thing. Where do you need thing. to go? We'll follow you. Hey, that's what an idea. When I sat down and he stood up, I thought that meant he didn't want to be near me. I'm so happy I saved you. Although, like, Connor finds Jericho anyway. And I freaking killed him. <laughs> that sucks, but at least I fixed it. Also, I'm really hungry. I haven't eaten anything all day. I haven't had an appetite all day. Because I've been so nervous about getting into this game. <sighs> Jerry? Jer how the heck did Jerry get- Uh-oh. Uh, 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 uh how you doing? What's your system status? I'm okay. Bullet didn't hit any by components. You could have been killed trying to save me, Marcus. Yeah. You have to think of our people first. Are you That's not one of my people? Uh, survivors. How many of us survived the attack? A few hundred. Maybe more if you count those hiding all over the city. Like Luther? If you hadn't triggered the bomb, we'd all be dead. That's why the game didn't give me a choice. Okay. Um, camps. The situation's not great for me. Camps in the Detroit area. Oh, those They're camps. Building more all across the country. They're preparing for a genocide. Mm -hmm. In a few hours, it'll all be over. We'll have changed the world, or the world will have destroyed us. All that you have to make a choice, Marcus. Is that we try? But whatever you choose. We will follow you. I love you, Marcus. I, I love you too. 
But like, I don't know guys, it kind of came out of nowhere, it seems forced. Sorry! I mean, it might just be me. I'm not into romances to begin with. But, I don't know. I'm glad she likes me, you know? That's awesome. And at least they're being subtle about the whole romance thing, which is not what I've heard the reputation of David Cage games is. But, yeah. So, it'll be... It's fine. It just kind of seems like it came out of nowhere, is all. So I'm just kind of like, oh right, we're in love. <laughs> Hey, Josh. You alright? You wouldn't be, if I had saved you. Mm. If it weren't for you, I'd be dead. Yeah. Thanks to you, I might see our people free one day. Yeah. That's you a fucking journey over agreed, there. But I know. Ow! We're fighting for the same thing. Was that ever Whatever a question? Whatever you decide. I'm with you, Marcus. Yay! Cool. Okay. You're a freaking Jerry. Where did the Jerry's come from? How did they find this place? Why so many androids outside of Jericho have the key to Jericho? I mean, I'm confused as to how the whole thing works, but the point is it works. <laughs> Inform your people of your choice. What choice is that? Is it the pacifist or violence again? Because, like, I will say, I really like... I like Marcus. I need to reapply my lipstick. Hold on a sec, guys. Sorry. BRB. It looks all chapped and weird, and my voice sounds really weird without a headset on. <laughs> Hold on. Ah! I'm still clipped here. Um, what was I saying? Right. I, I like Marcus. Um, of the three, Connor's my favorite, but... I think Marcus is my least favorite, and that doesn't necessarily mean that I don't like him. I like Marcus. The fact that he's taken this huge responsibility on himself um, to free an entire people is crazy. How come I can't hear anything? Uh, it's the amount of choice in in his whole story is... It seems more black and white than the others. You know, like, you're either a pacifist, which the public is gonna like, or you're violent, which the public isn't gonna like. It's very black and white. You know, it's 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 very common sense driven. You don't want to piss off the humans if you want them to accept you. You know, it, 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 it just seems very black and white. So when it came down to what I was gonna do, it was never any question. You know, if, if you want there to be peace, you don't antagonize the situation. It just seems very black and white to me. Oh, maybe that's the problem. I must have. Yeah, I did. When I, when, I, when I took off my headset, I turned the volume down a bit. Sorry! I can't believe Connor's a deviant, guys. This is nuts. Bark, bark! Humans have decided to exterminate us. Our people are packed in camps right now, being destroyed. How many times have we done this over the course of human history? And Time has come to make us? a choice. One that very well may determine the future of our people. He's so emotional. Public opinion is supportive. March peacefully toward the camps to pressure the authorities or launch an assault. We can't. Revolution. We, we can't do that. Demonstration. We have to. I've come this far being peaceful. Hasn't really gotten me anywhere good, but I've come this far. My stance has not changed. I know. I know you're all angry. And I know you want to fight back. That's but I assure you, violence is not the answer here. It never has been. We are going to tell them, peacefully, that we want justice. Screw up. If there's any humanity in them, they will listen. And if not, others will take our place and continue this fight. Are you ready to follow me? I love this music so much. Marcus, 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 Marcus. Wow. Okay, we're... We're doing this. Night of the Soul. 
Okay, um, I was going to say, that's the same music that plays when you're doing the broadcast at Stratford Tower. It's very ethereal and just... I love it. I confided in Carl. What the heck is all this, then? That's a, it's on whether or not I... Oh, oh, no, oh! 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 Okay, so that's confirming. It's possible for Carl to not die in Broken. Oops. I would have I would have no need to visit the cemetery if he's not dead. That can apparently be very different. Ugh. Jericho was attacked and cross That cannot well I suppose if Connor doesn't find Jericho, right? If if you screw up time and time and time and time and time again and don't find Jericho, um then they have no reason to attack because they don't know where we are. The whole last chance Connor thing. Ugh. I didn't want I didn't want Connor to be deactivated as a failure. I didn't want Connor to be a failure. I talked to North, Simon. I shared a moment with her. I talked to Kara. Talked to Josh. Spared Connor? I couldn't fucking kill him. Who would do that? Who would do that? Damn, I wish I could access world stats right now. Who, who, how many people killed Connor? How many? You're on my fuck you list permanently. How dare you? Even though I'm slightly hypocritical because I killed Connor too, but that's different. Marcus chose to protest for his people. Okay. What? Wait, what? Software instability deviant. Wow. If that's been question marks all game. It's crazy. Okay, uh, what the heck? Could I have played as Connor in Night of the Soul? I went up and talked to him. What more do you want from me? I'm debating on whether or not to restart again. I don't want to risk- I can always pause the game. I can always pause the game. Okay. At 6 a.m. this morning, a hey, national curfew was declared. Civilian movement will be strictly controlled. The right to assembly is suspended. All electronic communications are restricted, and I have granted enhanced powers to our security she is agencies. Like straight up Hillary In addition Clinton right to now, these measures, all androids must be handed over to the authorities immediately. Temporary camps are being set up in all our major cities to contain and destroy but them. But the public likes me! I am now asking all civilians to cooperate with the authorities and rest assured that everything in our power is being done to guarantee the security of our nation. Guarantee the security against Madam a SWAT President. team! Oh, shit. Um, 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 uh, leader? Has the leader of the Deviants been apprehended? Why am I controlling the, the president? That's crazy. Known as Marcus has not been located yet, but we will soon track it down and neutralize it. Madam President! Talk faster, please. Please? Oh, hi. Please? Um, um army. Is it true that androids make up 60% of the armed forces? Oh, really? Are still able to ensure our homeland security? We neutralized all military androids the second their reliability came into doubt. We have called the National Guard for reinforcement. Neutralize? Armed forces are fully operational and are able to ensure our homeland security. They didn't fucking do Please. anything. Madam I saw public opinion. I want that. Madam President, public opinion seems to have become increasingly favorable to the deviants, particularly since they've adopted a peaceful approach. How do you feel about this? Public opinion is one thing. The security of the state is another. These deviants Does the word democracy mean anything to you? My highest priority is to protect the American people. Madam President! What about over here? Please! In um, intelligent life. Many believe that androids are a new form of intelligent life. Do you have any comments? That's ridiculous. What is a this fuck you, bitch? Question, please? Madam President! Wow, okay, she just totally freaking rubbed Madam me President. off there. Cyberlife. What's gonna happen to Cyberlife? I know Will you're connected to be banned them. definitively? We're working very closely with Cyberlife to neutralize all deviants. Stop we saying that word! Anything else until we've dealt with the android question. Neutralize. Thank you. That will be all. Get out of here! 
I don't like you as much as I don't like the Madam President Caldwell in Splinter Cell. Is that her name? I think it is. Madam Presidents in fictional universes are always such bitches. Please, this has got to be Connor, right? My God, you've got to three one three two four eight three one seven. I'm expected. Identification successful. Okay. Ooh, you're good. Go ahead. What is it? Who are you? What do you want? <laughs> I still haven't seen Incredibles 2 yet, as of the 28th, but yeah, I have not seen The Incredibles 2 yet. And I wanna, I had plans to go see it in theaters, but then it ended up not happening for whatever reasons, and that's a huge ass tower. How am I supposed to find what I'm looking for in that thing? That's the freaking Spire from Horizon Zero Dawn, dude! This place is intimidating as all get out. Oh god. They're just killing it. We didn't do we never even had any weapons! Maybe we did at one point, but come on now. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm nervous. I'm scared. I'm nervous. I'm scared. Focus. 